hello dear students welcome to axiomatic course this video is the part of the solution series for iit jam 2020 so we are here with this problem 53 of your paper this problem is a problem from differential calculus it's a several variable problem so what is given to us that we are given with a function of two variable and we have to find out its minima all right so what i will do i will tell you firstly the procedure how to find out minima of a two variable function and then we will proceed so see this is the test that i have written for you in order to find out the maxima and minima for a two variable function so we have fxy as a two variable function so we are saying that if del f over del x is equal to del f over del y at a comma b is zero and this thing d is equal to is greater than zero and this thing is non-zero then f has relative extrema at a comma b if del 2 f over del x2 is less than zero then maxima otherwise minima right so this is a very easy test to remember so let us apply this on your given function fxy so fxy is given by x square plus xy plus y square minus 3x minus 6y plus 11 so let us calculate del f over del x so del f over del x so del f over del x is 2x plus y minus 3 what is del f over del y it is uh, y not y sorry x x plus 2y minus 6 so what you need is in order to find out the relative extrema what you have to do you have to find out a comma b such that del f by del x and del f by del y both satisfies that position all right so that means we have to place this thing equal to zero if you will place these two things equal to zero you will get 2x plus y is equal to 3 and x plus 2y is equal to 6 so now let us solve these two equation multiply this with 2 what you will get and then subtract you will get minus 3y is equal to uh, 9 then you will get y is equal to 3 All right so if y is 3 so what will be x it will be x will be just keep it here you will get x as 0 all right so we got this coordinate a comma b that is 0 comma 3 so now let us calculate the remaining thing del 2f over del x del y so del 2f over del x del y actually means that you have to just differentiate del f over del x del f over del y with respect to x so if you will do that what you will get is 1 plus uh, I am differentiating this with respect to x so you will get just 1 all right now let us calculate del 2f over del x2 so if you will do this then you will get 2 all right so everything is correct it is non-zero also let us calculate del 2f over del y2 so del 2f over del y2 is given by all right so there is a problem here what i told you earlier was actually wrong it will be del 2f over del x2 del 2f over del y2 all right so this should be your correct equation now so what will be del 2f over del y2 it will be uh, just 2 so just pro uh, calculate this d so d will be according to the product it will be 2 not 2 actually it's 4 so you will get 4 minus 1 so it is greater than 0 it is satisfying this condition so 0 comma 3 is a point that satisfy this one this condition and also this condition and also this condition so everything is satisfied so what we have to check we have to check the del sine of del 2f by del x2 now see the sine of del 2f by del x2 is actually positive that why that means that f of xy attains minima 
at 0 comma 3 let us calculate it f of 0 comma 3 will be uh, 0 plus 0 plus 9 minus 0 minus 18 plus 11 so 11 plus 9 will be 20 20 minus 18 will be 2 so 2 will be your answer for this question all right so thank you